and welcome to the KGDL5 development video. I've been chatting on the Kerbalnet chat. Yeah, that sentence. And I figured out I would like to finish working on the flash draw series. So I have absolutely no idea at what stage I have finished the KGD L5 development last time. I think I have managed to do the ma mastery area. Uh, all the secrets should be done. Let me check. There should be at least two secret rooms per level. Okay, there are two in the 17th level. And there are two in the 18th level. Two in the 19th, or three even. Okay. One. And two in the 20th level. Okay, so this part is done. Then another problem or thing to do is the achievements. So I'm just going to take a quick peek on the second screen at the Flash Development, uh, Flash Draw Development Forum. forum. Uh, episode 5, level discussion. Is there anything about achievements here? No, there's a lot of comments from Robin, and I'll have to make sure I have included all of them. Uh, achievement, no, level 25, no. I'm pretty sure there was a topic on the birds, boards, not birds, on the boards about achievements. Let me ch actually let's open the game. And uh, no, there are no achievements in the game at the moment. So let's go to the achievements menu. Achievement. Now let's make a class for the KGDB5. What is this? Okay, it's not used. Achievements. Uh, I think we are playing, rather compiling KGD5. Use the KGD class. Okay, uncompleted achievements. Huh. Okay, a bit choppy, you say. Uh, not this window. Mm. Let's see. Not this. Uh, not this. Okay, then I'll try. Jet is saying that the sound is getting a bit choppy. I assume that changing the volume might help. Is it any better now? And in the meantime, I will go around my business. Okay. So I need to find where are the achievements for the fifth episode. Are listed possible achievements. Huh. Okay, I have found the list. Getting better again. Okay. Um. Hmm. I could probably disable the nice redu reduction. So would that help? Uh, I don't have any phone headphones, so I can't really check. Okay, uh, I will just simply reduce the volume a little bit, and I'm going to speak louder. So hopefully this will work better. Okay, so I have found a achievements for the 
fifth episode. So right now, teach them one by one if they are actually they should be doable. So let's skip the doable part and simply implement them. Okay, so let's go to 17th level. It's one north, one west. One north, one west. Okay. Edit room. Uh, kill tar, drop all trapdoors, and leave through the north exit. Okay. North exit, you say. So, first achievement. Uh, it will be named Obsessive Compulsive and this is an ID which is not important right now. I will copy the description. Okay, uh, some kind of graphic. I'll go with uh, uh, are laying on the trapdoor. So, look, this is basically a function which generates the image for the achievement. So, let's go with this. We need to fill because the achievement image is made of 2x2 two two tiles. So, Nantar is mentioning that the achievement I'm working on right now to quote one of the nature achievements in the real thing but might be easier in the smaller room yeah apparently Robin said it was Robin yes yeah Robin it's Robin's comment possible and had a fair amount of fun with it so I hope it will be cool alright so we need the tar and tar north east north Northwest at zero zero northeast south southwest and southeast twenty two twenty two and twenty two plus twenty two level position should be number two room position is minus one minus one and room should not be conquered okay. Ah, uh, this failed. <laughs> okay, if have a function for let's see, uh, trapdoors being left. No. <clears throat> yeah, I. I think it's, it has been at least one year since I have worked on this game, so I don't really remember. I don't really remember how the how the code looks. So right now I need to make sure that the trappers drop. So is there any event for trappers being dropped? Trap the removed. Trap door. All trap doors removed. Yes, that's what I need. So we need to check for Q event. Let's go back. Actually, let's remove all of the achievements below. They are, they are only going to be to create noise. Uh, if Q events has a cured. If not, return false. And tar. how do I check if there's any tar in the room? Player in event has tile. Ah, this one might be what I'm looking for. If has tile. Return mm. false. Yeah, this is going to be not for correctly. So let's change this to trapdoor. Uh, 
uh, yeah it's checking the layer for the elements so all that's left to check is this so let's try to get this achievement now okay, and also I don't need the same okay, level position 2, room position minus 1, minus 1 yes and the room is not conquered that's the starting the first faction here is the starting requirements for the achievement to even be considered Restore... Yeah, I guess uh, I felt that all I had left to work on was uh, the... Let's enter this correctly. I felt that I still had a bit of work left. And Chaco is asking if... Let me go to this. Uh, actually... Ah, okay. So, if I'm understanding this code correctly, Flash Draw checks every turn whether or not a room achievement has been triggered by pulling the room state at the end of every turn. Not exactly. There are two things to consider. Uh, at the moment you enter a room, each of the unachieved achievements is checked with this function, which basically makes sure that you are in a correct room and the starting state is correct. In this case, uh, it will only consider uh, checking the achievement if you are in the second level at the room at this position and only if the room has not, be has not yet been conquered. Afterwards, it's like you said, at the end of each turn there is a function being executed which checks if you have done the achievement or not. It's pretty different from the way it works in the second sky, because in the second sky you do the achievements with uh, scripting, but as you may notice, flash drop predates uh, the second sky. So I just did it the hard way uh, and the achievements are hard-coded into the logic of the game. So what I wanted to check now... Uh, hey. Stop crashing! Okay, I think, I think I know what's the problem. Let's do it a little bit differently. Uh, I have tried to open the achievements window and there are too few achievements, so it crashed. Or froze, basically. Okay. Continue playing. Alright. Okay, this function is executed, so as long as there is any trapdoor in the room, it will return false. So this, it won't go further than this condition until we clear all of the traps. So let's go and do that. Uh... Whoa, 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 wait, wait, wait. You know what, this room is not as easy I, as I have thought it would be. So let's make it like that. We need to run for... Okay, let's restart from the beginning. I'm just going to make a run for it. Okay, so this star should be should be possible to clear this star. Uh, <laughs> which two by three passage? There are quite a lot of them. 
two by three. Ah, yeah, this one. Yeah, you're right. But it should be possible to clear all of the tunnel. Oh. I'm not dying to be here. It's like let's play my own game. Which. I mean, I like playing club. But I prefer the. regular game over the. flat version. Okay. No, 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 no. Should be possible now. Unless I die. Okay, so I have dropped the last trapdoor. And it's no longer returning false at this section, so right now it's checking if all of the tower has been removed. So we can place our breakpoint here. If you don't know how it works, okay, a short introduction if you're not a programmer. Basically, a breakpoint will be will stop the execution of the program and return you back to the editor at the moment when the code execution path excuse me, enters this exact line. I should have brought myself something to drink. But I didn't, so I will have to be thirsty. Okay, so all of the tower has been removed. It has, it went to this line. Okay, I should not be awarded the achievement for this because there are still tower babies in the room. But the moment I kill the last one, voila! Obsessive compulsive and I completely screwed up the image. <laughs> okay, let's try again. Uh, yeah, because uh, the directions in the name of the variable refer to the to the flat side, so it should be in, it's inverted. It should be southeast, southwest, northeast and northwest. Okay, so it's one one achievement done and yes, yeah, Nantra has mentioned in the original that condition the condition about uh, no wait wait. And basically Nantra has mentioned that uh, the condition about leaving the room by the north is trivial right now, so there is no need to there is no need to uh, make it so, actually. Yeah, Chaco is making a very good point that the player can get stuck. I need to check that his position is somewhere around the edge of the room. So let's make it like this. Let's not make it like that. Uh, get master. I really should have made myself a couple of functions that... Okay. Okay, no, never mind. This will work perfectly. So, if the room is not conquered, uh, escape early and early. I don't remember how to pronounce it. So we need another function um, to make sure the player is outside the... is capable of leaving, so... Uh, return... Oh, wait, wait, player in... Um, 1, 1... 25, 23... and that. Okay, just for wait, what are you doing? Okay, um, I'm going to.
comment out these conditions for now. So I also need to get rid of the achievements. And there are a couple of debug functions I have made which I don't remember keys for. Okay, I'll just change the um, storage name so all of the press will be lost and it doesn't matter really. Alright, let's try again. Compile, compile, compile. Start game. Start new game. Entrance ten. Welcome to drops. Blah 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 blah. Uh, on the side note, uh, this game could use a better tutorial. I mean, it works for the. <laughs> Okay, uh, change the sub changing subjects. Okay, the check that the player is capable of leaving the room is working correctly. So, uh, I have mentioned this in the chat that I want to um, make it possible. Uh, wait, 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 I'm thinking about two things at once. I want to make it that I want to release further episodes after KHD DL6, which will be levels 21, 25th. <laughs> Check his comment. The Dirt community has been spending eight years trying to build a better tutorial. That's true. Maybe I will, I don't know, incorporate the entry point <laughs> into the game so we all have two holds in one for each, for each uh, for each game. So yeah, if I'm going to release more holds after that, uh, there really should be at least at least one level for each of the game, which will introduce at least the basics. So a player who plays the game for the first time should not feel too isolated. But in the meantime, another achievement to implement. So let's go for Not Thirsty, level 18. Ooh. Let's go, let's stick to the level 17 ones. Uh, one north, one west, level one. Wait. Ah, yeah, hello, only one spawn. So it's another achievement for the same room. Interesting. <laughs> there should be another achievement for doing both of the both achievements at the same time. Uh, let's name it Actually you know what? I want you people in the chat to come up with a name for the achievement which is to complete this room uh, with Without allowing a second, uh, only allowing the tar mother to grow once. So give me your best. Okay. And in the meantime, I will be busy implementing this achievement. So um, let's remove the trapdoors. Why am I even drawing this? I know. And let's make it so it's all tar. North, south, east, west. 22, 22, 22, 22. And let's go with ice. Uh, mother, tar. Tar baby? No. Tar technician? No. How does this code even work? Set graphic. Oh yeah, the theme other. Okay. Tar Kibosh. Okay, I I recognize the name Kibosh, but I have I 
have no idea what that is. Uh, I open east. And I open west, and it should be at 0, 11 and 22.11. Okay, position stays. This data. Um, yes, data, was it? Uh, like this. <coughs> Uh, if if Q events uh, has a cured CID uh, tar group, this stop data suppose plus plus. And return if the data spoon is bigger than one, return false. Otherwise, return true if there's no tar mother in the room. So get monster tar mother. Mm. Yeah. Uh, to the heart of the matter. Can't you get the matter even quicker by clearing the room, creating a new baby and exiting west? Uh, no, doing it like this will get you stuck, but the better solution is to go north after you kill the tar mother um, basically like this open the door just create another baby undo because you die undo because stuff yeah the replay engine does not support um, teleportation okay and um, let's try not to die so yeah once you leave here Get this way, but still, there will be at least one. Spawn. <laughs> also, I need to check is it possible to kill the tar mother in a single spawn if you go from here? Because it should not be possible. And it is not possible. Okay. Uh, uh, wrong window. Okay. Mm, open the chat. Uh, so I like clear the traffic jam to the heart of the matter. I like this one the most. Okay, let's try to get this new achievement. Let's make sure it cancels correctly. Uh, let's wait for the game to compile. Alright, start game. Continue playing. Okay, so once the second spawn hits, the function will quit early. Let's restart. Uh, yeah, okay, the eyes looked okay. Uh, so it's another achievement implemented. Only 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 more to go, plus the filling ones like clear the first level, clear the second level, and so on. So let's go to level 17, 2 south, 1 east. 2 south, 1 east. Here. Yeah, okay. Why south once east? Don't use the potion. Oh yeah, it's this <coughs> this room. Let's see. It's a pretty
Pretty. Ah! And the reward achievement. Oh. Say. Yeah. Actually, what's the potion for? It's easy to the heart of the matter. Thank you, Nantor. <laughs> I can do it myself. I like this achievement. I'll go with this one. With I can do it myself is let's go with full capitals. Oh yeah, okay. The potion is to help clean up any tar babies trapped behind uncuttable tar. That's a good observation. I will go with a simple design for this. Uh, I need some floor. And for the floor I will need to look for a... Actually... No, I don't think I need the floor because yeah, there's this default background, so I can do it myself. Let's change the description. And let's, in the graphic, let's have a Mimic Potion. Potion Mimic. In the top left corner, and in the opposite, upper, crap, opposite corner, south east, we will have Bifro facing away from the potion. And actually, let's make it uh, north east and the potion at the bottom because the potion is placed in the lower left corner of the room, so it will fit thematically. Okay, it's. One east, two south, and used potion equals false. If used potion, which one false? Uh, position one of twenty three. If player in one twenty three, one twenty three. Change the used potion to true. Return event, event conquered. Uh, oh crap. Oh crap. Oh crap. I changed the wrong achievement. That's okay. We can undo. Undo. I should have never stopped recording the let's plays because my. English kind of got worse because of that, or maybe just because it's failing me today. Hmm. So, kill the mother before killing any babies. Is this even possible in the small version? Let's check. Oh no! Coming up with difficult achievements, okay? I'm having problems. Uh, 
yeah, coming from the east should be is preferable. Wait a second. How am I even supposed to kill the tar mother if I'm going to produce babies just by trying to trying to get to her? Ah, I know. I know. I know. Maybe it's possible right now. This will make it easier. South, East, West, get the North, West, try to first. <coughs> yeah, uh, I mean, maybe it's possible to do this with... Oh, crap! Might be possible to do this the without moving the Tar Mother's eyes, but I'm not sure it's... to simply move a trapdoor or two around. Okay, I know what's the problem, I'm facing the wrong direction. So if I go here first, then this one, this one, here, here, yes, yes, it works. Okay, I like this achievement actually. I'm going to export the hole by the in the meantime. The project drop flash drop okay. So I'll go with Spare of the Innocence as named by Chaco. Uh, kill the tower model before killing our babies. Uh just so we know the, the current descriptions are only temporary. I will make them better uh, sometime later. Okay. Let's just go with a simple design with two tar babies facing south. Just go simply fail, really. It failed. Uh. Okay, if player kills Tower Baby. It should fail. But if the player has not yet failed, uh, if get monster, tar mother, if there are no more tar mothers in the room. Let's return match win equals let's set match win to true. And if this update match win return once the room is conquered. Um, when the room is conquered and when the player is not outside is still still capable of leaving. So, yeah. 
this should work. So basically, going one by one. Uh, if you have not already, okay, let's rename it. If the player has killed the Tower Mother before babies, and the room is already conquered, and the player is at the edge tile, where it went through. Otherwise, if you kill a Tower Baby, you fail. If you fail, you fail. Yes. You fail if you fail. I'm so deep. And if there are no more Tar Mothers and you have not yet failed, we change the name of variable kill mother before babies and this can return all, always return false because it does not matter. Uh, we set this to true and we get back here. Okay, let's see if I have not broken anything. Spare the innocence. Da -da 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 -da. Continue playing. Okay, let's place myself here. Uh, let's see. Okay, if you kill a baby, you fail. If you kill the Tower Mother, you win. Okay. Nice. Did I get the achievement? Oh yeah, I need to go to the edge. Yes! The graphic is wrong. Ah, uh, sure, sure. Okay. Tar baby self, I mean, tar baby self. Okay, so we have one, two, th three achievements. Let's make this last one before we finish. And it is <clears throat> level 17. One south, two east. Kill serpent before any tar babies form. What? What? Oh yeah, okay, I know what the problem, because originally... Actually no, it's still possible, what I'm talking about. Yeah, it's a pretty good example, as Chaco said, about how it's like to be a programmer. <laughs> yes, the achievement works, the graphics wrong, yeah. You're completely right. You get one thing done, and you break three other. So, uh, this room looked a little bit different when the achievement was conceived because there were, um, I think there were either broken walls here or something like that. So what I'm going to do right now is to... possible to do this achievement. The first thing you need to do is close this uh, yellow, yellow gate and then you need to wait a little bit. And wait. Oh no! Come on, snake. Stop being a jackass. Okay. No. 
let's try again. I'm kind of worried that this is going to end up being a really boring snake manipulation puzzle. Okay. I would, uh, Nantro says, I would just push the serpent west so his head is stuck in the tower when it grows. Yeah, it's a pretty valid strategy. Uh, but why do it like this when you can do it like. Well, certainly not like that. Okay. <coughs> But this makes it a pretty terrible timing puzzle. Unless we change something and make it actually... Yeah. If only this snake went south. I'm going to try to make it a less terrible timing puzzle. Uh, okay, like this. That's something like that. So it basically should solve itself. The idea is so that it will solve itself. But it's not. Okay. Arsh, come on. Serpent. I want, I want this to, I want to make this timing puzzle, but a linchpin timing puzzle, not something that you need to repeat thousands of times to get it right. It just should work gracefully by just making you stand where you started. Well, okay, maybe not exactly where you start, but somewhere around that place. Let's change the snake. Let's see. How will this work? See? Beautiful execution. Beautiful. <laughs> Is there a secret here? Yes, there is a secret. Follow secret. Nothing new. Okay, so... It doesn't change the fact that it's still a turbo puzzle. Um. Let's let's get back to the original. So basically, if I stand here, it just magically solves itself. Okay. I think it's good enough. It's not very difficult, but unless you come up with the idea, it's it's pretty, it can be pretty challenging, especially for someone who is not well versed in the way the snakes work. 
So we'll go with this solution. Mm. Oh yeah, so I want to change the way the orbs work to how they work before. Because now that you can... Because right now I want to force the player to use the tar uh, in this phase, of the, at the beginning of the room, to kill the snake, not to try to stop the tar from growing here. Yeah, basically I have no idea what I'm talking about. I need something to drink, so I'll just quickly implement this achievement. <clears throat> Come with me, please. I would be really grateful because I'm out of ideas. Okay, the graphics will go with some tar on the west side. Don't ask, don't ask what I'm doing with this finger. Tar, mm, north, south, west, yes. Some tar on the west side. Uh, and a snake on the west side, east side. Yeah. Mm. Serpent, snake, head, west. Uh, it can be here. Actually, let's make it in the middle. Okay, room position is one south, two east. So we changed the, this. Uh, failed. Uh, is serpent dead? Okay. So it basically follows the same idea as the previous room. So the serpent is dead. <coughs> Before tar babies spawn. Okay, okay, okay. If not cat monster, tar. If not serpent, yeah, serpent. Not serpent in the room. And if there's any tar baby, we should fail. If no serpent, we should unfail. Conquer player in. Okay. Simple enough. Some temporary name. Let's try. Okay, so first of all, if any tar baby spawn, it should fail terribly. We fail, fail. Okay, I think a tar baby has spawned. Has spawned? That's not like that. Now, killing the snake. It's not as easy as you might Come on, stop killing me! Do you have nothing? That will give you life. Okay, so killing the snake does not work. But if you stay here, it does not work. But if you stay here, the snake dies. Yes, okay. And it should be possible to get the achievement now. Clear. Is, it? Is it? Yes, some temporary name. Okay. So this was the last achievement I will be implementing today. 
it leaves me with 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 4, 14, I don't know, I lost count. Uh, thank you for watching. Mm, it was fun. I hope to make it to do this again. I'll probably work on the game in the meantime. I could use a couple of achievements for level 19, it seems, since there are none. But I'm pretty sure I will come up with something once I'm finished with the current ones. So, thank you for watching and goodbye. Dramatic silence. Ah. <sighs>